You'll probably notice a lot more boots and cowboy hats around town this week as hundreds of high schoolers from around the state come to the key city to compete in one of our largest rodeos. The Texas High School Rodeo Association Finals is here. KRBC's Jessica Rank was there at check-in this afternoon to get a glimpse of some of the competition hitting the arena this year. The boots, hats, and steers have arrived. Get rodeo ready, that's what I like to call it. These high school kids are the cream of the crop. These are really special kids. They've worked really hard. They're very good athletes, and they're coming here to compete for a title in the state. More than 600 young athletes and one who's hoping to bring home a roping title back to Snyder, Kate and Prince. Uh, it's, it's a lifestyle. It's what I want to wake up every morning and go. I want to rope and get better. And that's just how, like, I just want to live my life being a team roper. Prince has been roping since he was three years old, and now a junior in high school, he's ready to put those hoofs to the dirt and get going. It's a mental deal. You got to be mentally sharp and just don't worry about it and go and rope your steers. Competing against one of his good friends, Wyatt Lloyd. Together, this isn't their first rodeo, and they know in order to win, it's about teamwork and the relationship you build with. With your partner. I met mine three years ago and he only lives about five miles down from my house so we rope together all the time. We're really close and so it's like we know what each other's going to do and what our moves are so when it's something happens I know how he's going to react to it and, and it's easier that way when you get to know your partner really really good. A sport that along with others at this year's rodeo takes dedication. You got to be fully into it. It's no half like not wanting to do it. It's you got to go every day and put forth effort for it. And that's why all of these athletes are here, hoping to prove themselves and be the best of the best in Texas. In Abilene, Jessica Rank, KRBC, Abilene's local news. All right, thanks, Jessica. Both Wyatt and Caden are set to compete this Tuesday. The Texas High School Rodeo continues through June 15th.